Hey guys, I've decided that all three tutorials this week is going to be for furniture, so I hope you'll enjoy. Quite a few of you have asked me where I've learned to make furniture. I'm self-taught, I get inspired by real furniture and pictures of furniture and then just make it my way. So today I'll show you how I made this tall shelving cabinet thingy. First off, you just want to make a sketch of the basic design. I did make some adjustments as far as the design goes along the way, so the pieces you're going to need first are two for the sides, then skip this skinny stick looking thing, you'll need a piece for the back, a piece for the bottom, a bridge type piece for the bottom of the front, and a decorative piece for the top of the front. You'll also need a piece for the top, which didn't fit in the frame, but you want it to be slightly larger than the bottom piece. It's going to make more sense once you see it being put together. Transfer everything to the wood of your choice, I'm using bass wood again. You can also make these from cardboard, cardstock and paper. One thing I chose not to show in the video just to save time is me sanding the pieces of wood. You'll need to sand the edges after cutting them out and also during the process if some of the pieces don't fit together perfectly. Now glue the sides to the back. Add the decorative pieces to the front and the bottom piece. Then for the top, measure and draw a line around the cabinet and use a funnel to add details to the edges. Now cut as many pieces as you want shelves and a door for the cabinet.
For the door I decided to attempt doing some simple wood carvings, so I made an outline with a pencil and used a craft knife to carve the wood. I then added watered down brown acrylic paint to the entire unit. Lastly, I added a thin layer of a warm white acrylic paint and once that had dried, I went over it with a file to give it an old, worn look. I also added some of the patina to the hinges and knob. 